Hey, how's it going? I'm False Proof. Welcome back to Rune Factory Frontier. Someone just knocked on the door. It's 6 a.m. I wrote in my journal and I slept. Oh, why do they gotta keep moving the world while I'm asleep? I haven't been here in a while. And I guess this is a lesson I have to learn. That the world keeps moving while I'm not here. Anyway, let's uh, find out what's so important at 6 a.m. I don't know what it could be. It could be anything, honestly. 6 a.m. This is ridiculous, honestly. Well, at least I get a nice anime cutscene. That would it's always fun. You have to fill out an application if you move. Dude, dude, I'm I just sorry. got here. Give me some slack. Never mind. Oh. <laughs> here you go. I have some mail for you. Well, gee, thanks. I bet you it's a very important letter. Oh, it's very yeah. nice and green. Mail? Yep. I'm Annette. I deliver the mail here in Trampoline. Well, that's good to know. Hi, and Annette. You? Oh, I'm false. Oh, nice to meet you. Oh, and there goes her band of sheep, who apparently can run on their hind legs. Annette, so you're a mailman. I mean male woman, but whatever. Oh, right, I got some mail. Let's see. Welcome. Nice to meet you from Annette. Thanks very much, Annette. Because, you know, you totally had to wake me up at 6 a.m. to give me a letter welcoming me to the village. Thanks a lot, Annette. That's what I actually wanted. You know, I was setting my alarm for 9 a.m. You just screwed it up, Annette. Thanks a bunch. Thanks so much. So I've tended to my farm, picked up all the stuff, you know, grew my one crop. Now, I really, really, really want to find Whale Island. I feel like that's going to be the most important thing next. With that being said, I wonder where we can go. I think maybe Stella might be a good idea. If we, if we feel lost and need guidance, come visit Sister Stella. So, you know, Stella is almost like your tips and tricks kind of guide. She's the best way to get through the game i suppose because then she'll just tell you where to go it's just great oh my god stella wake up stella oh okay i just walked up here all right there's a i guess it's a clock tower that's such a big clock tower it doesn't seem to be working though oh oh here's stella she's here now i guess i guess i woke you up stella isn't that a grand isn't that a grand clock tower the clock tower was here before I came to the village. But I've never seen it work, not even once. I had a lot of people look at it, but it just won't work. You can't go inside right now, but it'll be opened up after the cleanup is done. Oh, false proof. Oh. I'm sorry. This is this is just turning into infamy. But here's this big giant plant. Maybe if we water it, let's see what happens. Alright, we're just gonna There we go. And Yes! Okay, that's what you gotta do. You gotta water that random beanstalk all the way up to Whale Island. That's in front of the clock tower for some reason. Again, don't question it. This is Rune Factory logic. Actually, maybe to an even lesser extent. It might even be like Harvest Moon logic. Wow, that surprised me. I didn't think it could grow this big. Still, it's so huge. It's like it reaches the heavens. Should I try to climb it? Uh, sir, sir, I didn't, I, no, I didn't, I, we, we can't go up there yet. So this is Whale Island. It's a lot bigger than it looked from below. Ah, a new face. Are you an adventurer? I am below you. Nay, perhaps it is better to say I am above you? Who's there? Who are, wh wh where are you? Ha ha ha, my apologies. My mischief was excessive. I am the awareness of the very whale on which you stand. Whale, you mean this island? Correct. I was a mere cluster of rocks when I was gifted with awareness. By the influence of the runes, I began swimming through the skies. Runes? Runes are collections of spirits. Okay, like the cute little things that fly around. Although runes are formed by the earth, there are times when runes affect the earth instead. Adventurer, what is your name? Uh, I am false. False, I seek a favor. Although my awareness and body are sustained by runes, I feel as though the rune within me grows weak. If the rune were to ever disappear, my awareness would fade and my journey through the sky would end. The, those would, this, would be, be, this would be of grave danger to those who reside below. I'm sorry for my flub. I understand. I'll search for the answer to your failing rune. You have my word. You have my gratitude. It is not much but a sign of thanks. Allow me to guide you. You see that stone tablet? Do you see the stone tablet? It will make your dreams come true if you just 
granted the power of perception. It seems to have existed since before I became aware. No big deal. Casual plot device. And I sense a strong magic from it. It may be of use to you. I have yet more advice. Monsters inhabit the lands beyond here. They may return here now, but they re must. They, they might. They. They may reside here now, but they must return to their own world. False. Your weapons are enchanted with Retornan magic. Retornan is a magic that sends monsters back to their original place, their home to which they must return. The first forest. False. Please return the monsters lost in this world to their own. I'm counting on you, False. All right, so clearly we just have a water can. I think we might need to go buy a weapon. And who is good for that? Why? The blacksmith is obviously good for that. It starts with a G. I still can't remember her name. I'm so sorry. Listen, you might all be saying, well, maybe I just want you to be the suitor for the, the blacksmith, False Proof. And I understand your sentiment, but I've decided I want to go for Miss. Listen, nothing against anybody else, but I, I came here looking for Miss. And she's cutie. She's a little cutie. Thanks. Treat them nicely. Yes, I will. I didn't get any hearts. Whatever. Good luck out there. Oh, there are the hearts. I'm... Thanks, Ganesha. That's what I come here for. I come here for the good service and the hearts in your eyes. I'm still gonna try to take Miss though. So before we start anything, we gotta we gotta equip this we gotta equip this nice new broadsword that I just bought. Looks so great. It swings so nicely. Let's look, to, let's look at the stone tablet, though. The melody of trust grows within 12 maidens. I wonder what that means. And... You look, they shoot off light. It's crazy. But, I mean... Are there 12 girls we can suit her in this game? Don't know. I guess I should keep moving. Or maybe, you know, it's a Link to the Past reference. Who knows? But... We've got some monsters to kill. Get our skill up. You know, become a super awesome adventurer. And this is the best part of this game. It's like... Harvest Moon is great, but you just you feel like you want a little bit more. And this game just gives you that tiny, tiny little bit more with this super awesome dungeon exploring aspect. And it's like really cool. It's like real time. I like that a lot. And of course, they're very easy monsters to take down. Nothing too shabby. Nothing too, not, nothing too crazy, which is awesome. I got to make sure to be back before five so I can put all this stuff I find in here in our good old in our good old ship box. Although that warrior metal, not sure if I should take with me or ship out. Maybe it's worth a lot of money. I don't know. But let's grab some more weeds. Weeds are good. Maybe let's let's eat it. Let's eat a weed. That did absolutely nothing. I just I honestly feel cheated. Could have used those weeds for some nice old money, but nope. Nope, no money for me. And there you're both dead. Cool. All right. Oh, okay, there's some rocks. I feel like we need a pick for that. Unfortunately, we don't have a pick just yet. We're gonna have to find out exactly how to get that. Uh, hopefully it's not super, super hard. I don't think it is, which is good. But we gotta return these goblins to where they came. We gotta take out these generators. Because they're generating all the monsters and I do not need more monsters in my life. I just need like the sole minimum I need to get up my level. I want that level up, you know? That's what I'm looking for. Swing that sword. There we go. Level up. Perfect. And the good thing is with every level up, you get even more rune points. If you use too many rune points, you're obviously going to get tired. Just don't use up all your rune points. You'll be fine. Oh, oh. Okay. You want to you wanna spray your poison at me, boy? I swear to God, I will take you and your children down. I'm not dealing with spiders. When I worked in retail, I had to kill a spider once. It was a pregnant mama spider. It had a bunch of baby spiders inside. You know what happens when you crush the mama spider? You know what happens? No? You don't know. Well, I'm gonna tell you. All the babies come out, and that is not a fun time. Ugh, it was just ugh, it was gross. They were like, oh, you should clean it up, false. You're, 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 you're a manly man. And this was during a point when I looked even more juvenile than this. So it's like, there's really not a lot of faith in old false proof, the retail worker. Oh? Hey, False, it's me, Bathhouse Melody. I've never met you in my life. What are you doing here? That's what I want to know. There are a lot of monsters around here, you know? Well, I can smell that there's a hot spring around here somewhere. Okay. I think it's somewhere around that rock. That's good to know. Why don't you try breaking that rock? I, I guess I can give it a go there, Melody. I will, uh, I will try it out. Now, let me just, I'm just gonna equip this hammer real quick. Feel like we're, we gotta break, we gotta break this big old rock. 
and boom! And now we're gonna discover a magical hot spring with complete with an anime cutscene. <laughs> you dug up a hot spring. Of course I did. I'm the greatest rune factory farmer swordsman ever. I knew my intuition was right. Good job, Melody. I have no time to waste. Okay, you have no time to waste. All right, I'll be running a bathhouse. Be sure to come by. I will make sure to to run to come by. I will. Okay. Well, uh, we'll just we'll let her be for now. Oh, and you do you do some damage, sir. You do some damage. Do you do you do you do you certainly do. All right, we're gonna take down this generator. I do not need to deal with these level high monsters. I do not need that in my life. I'm just here for the awesome stuff. Maybe there's awesome free stuff that I haven't found yet. But my rune points are going down like crazy, so I just, I gotta make sure this is all worth it eventually. I'm just, I'm gonna keep moving. Okay, well, now there's even more stuff. Even more runes, even more everything. It's great. Uh, I'm just gonna grab this grass, and then we're gonna get on out of here, because I do not need this in my life. Okay. Or, oh, there's a little rune thing. I could grab that. Um, we're just gonna, we're gonna try to get out of here real quick. We're just gonna, we're gonna keep moving. Okay, we're we're almost okay. We're not gonna die. We're not gonna die. We're gonna be fine. We're gonna be fine. We'll try not to collapse. Try not to collapse. There, false proof. That would be a good idea. Okay. Yep. The good thing is they can't hit us from far away. Maybe that guy can. That would be creepy. What is this? I think there's something inside. Oh, I think we're supposed to put some sort of gem in there, but uh, not sure if I have the time for that. Oh. Okay, my poison status is gone. And now we go into a new area. Anything else that we're maybe missing out on? Oh, there's a treasure chest. We're gonna grab this, and then I think we gotta run, because it's not looking too good. All right, look in here. What's in here? Oh, pick up antidote herb. That is that is very good to have, honestly. Because sometimes you're just gonna get poisoned by the monsters, and they will uh, give you a bad time. Oh, and there's a wind crystal. That is good. We do have an offer on the table to go to a nice hot spring, so why don't we just do that? Oh, I see this uh, this random building has magically appeared. No, no big deal. Um, maybe this is a this is a hot spring place in the middle of Trampoli. Who knows? Welcome, Faust, to the Laga Springs. Laga Springs. Yep, that's the whale's name. It's called Laga. That's why it's called Laga Springs. I named it though. Taking the bath cleans the soul. So you should come every day. It's a great to relax by taking a bath. That's good to know, Melody. I know you just want me to spend my money in your establishment. That's all I'm good for for you, isn't it? That's all I'm good for. Um, that's the wrong way. Oh, this is the women's bath. I shouldn't go in here. That's, uh, maybe a good idea. Or, let's check upstairs. Maybe there'll be some cool stuff. Who knows? And the one thing I've noticed, especially... Oh, let's try not to... Let's try not to sleep in Melody's bed. That would be a... Oh, something smells very soothing. These, these must be the herbs inside the stuffed animals. Oh. Shit, no! Huh, I fell asleep. Oh. Oh. We were not supposed to fall asleep in there. That is weird. Okay, let's take this bath. Now, that I've never actually been in a hot spring. I, I wonder how the experience is. I, I bet it's probably pretty decent. You know, you get to just chill in here. And I think if we come here every day, we'll actually trigger a new cutscene, which will be pretty cool. And that felt great. Uh, look at him, he's all rosy-cheeked. And, oh, your meters go all the way back up, so it's it's just beneficial, you know, work a hard day on the farm, and then come back and, you know, invariably work, you know, get some work in. Now, before we go back to the farm, I wanna get some seeds from Danny. Now, what we can do is we can use this hammer to our advantage, because we have all these little rocks. And they, they kinda take up some room, but if we break them, we break them down, we can get a little bit more room for some more crops. And that is the goal. The goal is even more crops than we have before. Oh, there's mist. 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 Ah, mist. Hi, 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 mist. Growing crops in your field and then chipping them out is one of the fundamentals of ranch life. Good luck to you. I I gotta wait to give you some turnips, but uh, it'll come. It'll come, my dear. It'll come. Oh, okay. Here's Rosetta to come pick up the items. Good evening. I'm here to pick up the atoms for today. If I did, if I didn't do this, neither of us would make any money. Mm. Let's see. Now let's see what she finds. Oh, she's gonna find like a 500 billion weeds, cause that's just how I roll. I'm that guy. I kind of sell the the shop's weed. Oh, geez, you're shipping out weeds again. <sighs> Done. Now you, me, and the customers will all be happy. 
I'll be back tomorrow. Be sure to fill out the shipping box with crops before then. I'm just gonna, um, maybe this will be, this will be it for today. I, I farmed pretty hard. I did some pretty hardcore farming. Let's talk to Mist again, see what she's up to. On the opposite side of my home is where Eric is. I know who Eric, Eric is, young man. Yes, Eric is the best. Thanks for the tip, Rune. Wrist, Mist. If this girl's gonna be my wife there, false proof, you gotta remember her damn name. It's Mist. You know, like the thing that happens when the condensation in the air gets pretty pretty heavy and then the, the water vapor just kind of rises up a little bit it's called mist for a reason there boy god the things i have to go through with this guy the worst oh hello young man i've never seen you before who are you i moved here recently or i came to kidnap you let's go with the second option just because it's a little more interesting what so you know that i will be the future savior of the world and you've come to nab me you're actually pretty funny Oh, so you're the guy who moved in next door to Miss. That girl is so weird, don't you think? Hey, don't be saying that about my future wife. I'm Marco. My mom is the blacksmith here. Oh, I see. Couldn't tell from the elf ears there, big guy. I'm false. Nice to meet you, Marco. Nice to meet you, too. Let's fight each other sometime. I think I've gotten a lot stronger, so I think I can take you on. Well, uh, let's, uh, let's just uh, chill for a sec there, Marco. Maybe you should uh, keep it on the down low that you're a little bit of a future savior. Your mama might not want you to get into a little bit of a scrap. Especially with a, a strong, lean young man like myself. I'm a, I'm a pretty big, I'm a pretty tough specimen, if you will. I'm a, I'm a tough, I'm a tough customer, you know? You're gonna be bringing me into your store, you're gonna have some tough times. Although, to be fair, I just spent a bunch of money at his mom's house, or his mom's... His mom's house. That sounds weird. His mom's store. His mom has a store. It is not her house. It is an illegitimate business in the city village of Trampoli. It's all the same. Oh, oh, I'm digging myself into a big hole. I'm sorry, Marco. I'm so sorry. I think I'm, I'm going to retire to my homestead because uh, nothing's happening in town because this town sucks. But that's going to do it for this time. Thank you all so much for watching. Past episodes of Rune Factory Frontier can be found in the series playlist in your video window and in the description. All of my social media links and the link to my podcast are also in the description. And as always, set that ID value to false and I'll see you next time.